uh, I'm here to bring you uh, another kind of video. Today I'm going to talk about tea, which is one of my most consumed edible things. Uh, I have so many different kind of teas and I really adore tea. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about the things that I make tea with and then some of my favorite tea cups. Actually, some tea. So what I have here is a jasmine green tea, which is probably my favorite uh, kind of tea of all the time. I usually drink jasmine tea uh, only in the like evening because during the morning I really like to drink some black tea to give me some caffeine but uh, green tea is probably my favorite kind of tea so let's talk about my favorite teas uh, I only have like black teas here because I usually buy my tea from a local tea and coffee shop and I just don't really know if it's if it's uh, wise to tell you about these teas because you can't buy them because you are far away so I'm going to talk about some teas that I have been given uh, fro from my uh, from my relatives from abroad and then some teas that I just buy from shop. Uh, I usually drink loose leaf tea because I just feel like uh, it's so much better than, than the like from the bags. But usually during the morning I just I'm just so in hurry that I don't have time to uh, make make myself uh, a whole bunch of uh, loose leaf tea. So usually then I drink this. Uh, it's a Fortuna, Fortum Animation Famous Teas Earl Grey Classic. I used to uh, hate Earl Grey tea, uh, but now I have found comfort in it because it's usually the kind of teas that you always find when you go to cafe or if you buy something something to drink while you are in the campus. So I have started to like Earl Grey quite much. I always drink my tea just the way it is. No milk or sugar or honey. I just find it most comforting that way. Uh, one important thing uh, when making a perfect cup of tea is the temperature of the water. Like uh, black teas usually need like t uh, 100 degrees, but I I just want to make it clear that when you are making green teas, especially uh, important that you don't boil the water that you, you only left it like 70 or 80 degrees because usually people say that they hate green tea but I I have a wild guess that it's only because they drink too bitter green tea and just make it uh, let it let the water boil and keep it too much I kind of uh, over proved this tea so it's quite bitter but I still like it and then two of my luxury teas this is my favorite tea uh, brand of all the time and they are the Kas Kushmi tea uh, they are from uh, Paris they have a shop in Paris and uh, you can order them online, but it's quite ex expensive to order them online. So these are ones that my aunt who is living in France has bought me uh, the one They are both uh, black teas. This is a bouquet of flowers and this is St. Petersburg. I like these are classic 
plastic tea brands uh, that usually have a base in uh, Russian tea and I really adore them. They are almost finished and I'm quite sad. But like look at these little tins that they have in have tea in. They are so just so gorgeous. I'm thinking of turning them into candles when they are finished but these are my go-to teas every time. We actually have a cafe here in Oulu that sells um, sells kashmir tea that you can get your own brewed kashmir tea, tea there and I really love that that's my favorite cafe in the in the world because the tea is so good and I usually just go there and enjoy a cup of tea those were the tea brands that I had had to talk about I also love a uh, Bukka and yeah mostly just a uh, loose leaf tea that I buy from from um, <coughs> local tea shops but maybe I could talk about my beautiful beautiful teapot I got this uh, this year as a birthday present and I, I have always wanted to have a beautiful teapot so I usually just use like a filter here and just pour the water in and make tea you probably know how to make tea yeah but this is just so beautiful and it's a quite good size I usually like make a whole bunch of tea because I just adore tea so much and I could drink it I usually drink like three cups from this I'm I'm an addict and then some tea cups so like you have seen my Virginia Woolf mug a room of one's own penguin books so this was a gift from my friend who was visiting uh, London I can I think that you can get this from like bookshops but this is my favorite cup and it's quite good sizes sized and then I have some Finnish brands that you can probably get online and this is a beautiful cup um, and it's a quite good sizes uh, like if I want to have just one cup of tea I usually make the tea here because it's just such a good size and they you they also have like blue ones of the other print but this is just makes me feel like I'm in a fairy tale when I drink from this then some cups that you have probably seen in internet because they are mummy mummy mugs. I collect them. I have a whole bunch of these, but I wanted to pick some favorites of mine. This is probably the most recent. Uh, they are made by Arabia. I will link a website where you can buy mummy mugs from. Uh, I just buy buy them here in Finland from shops because Finland is the land of moomins but look at this gorgeous with two tiki and this is actually like limited edition mug that I bought some years ago it's really unusual color but I just love it so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found something nice about this video and if you have any recommendations of your favorite kind of teas just let me know because I'm always willing to try more teas and I hope you will prove a perfect cup of tea today and I see you all again soon.